Tip in, diving into the phrase. Hello, dear learners. Today, we're diving into a unique phrase in the English language, tip in. By the end of this video, you'll have a clear understanding of what it means and how to use it. Let's jump right in. Tip in can be a noun or a verb and its meaning varies depending on the context. Generally, it refers to a slight addition or insertion of something. 1. In sports, especially basketball, a tip in is a shot where the ball is tapped into the basket, especially following a rebound. 2. In publishing, a tip in is an extra page that is added to a book after the main pages have been bound. Now that you know its basic definition, let's see how tip in is used in sentences. 1. Basketball context. He scored with a brilliant tip in just before the buzzer. 2. Publishing context. The special edition of the book has a tip in with the author's autograph. While tip in seems straightforward, there are a few things to keep in mind. 1. Don't confuse with tip in without the hyphen. Tip in can mean giving a tip, as in a restaurant, inside a place. 2. Context is king. Always remember the context in which you're using tip in. In a basketball game, it's about the sport. In a bookstore, it's about an added page. And there you have it. The phrase tip in, in all its glory. We hope this video has shed light on this interesting phrase and its various uses. Keep practicing, and soon, using tip in, will be a slam dunk. Happy learning!